Just coming into Action News, two teenage brothers are in police custody, accused of killing a man found in Richland Township, Bucks County. Officials releasing gruesome details late this afternoon, saying the victim was repeatedly stabbed to death. Thursday afternoon, I'm Sarah Bloomquist. And I'm Brian Taft. The big story on Action News today is that homicide investigation unfolding right now in Richland Township, Bucks County, and the new details we learned just about one hour ago. Action News reporter George Solis live now at Doylestown at the Bucks County Justice Center. George, you've got the details now. That's right, Brian and Sarah. The details are gruesome and they are unfolding. Bucks County detectives, right, Richland Township, and Pennsylvania State Police are currently investigating. Now, Chopper 6 was over the scene of what we now know is a murder investigation involving two brothers from Somerset, New Jersey. Bucks County DA Matt Weintraub said the victim, whose name has not been released, was found this morning in a wooded area near the 500 block of East Pumping Station Road in Richland Township. Now, the victim was said to be found with stab wounds to his head, neck, upper chest, and arm. Now, the DA identified the suspects as 17 year old Joshua Gamble and 19 year old Anthony Gamble, both brothers. Joshua Gamble is expected to be charged as an adult in this case. Now, both brothers are looking at murder, conspiracy, position of an instrument of crime and tampering with evidence charges. The DA said it was a Pennsylvania state trooper that spotted the scene after finding a parked Subaru registered to one of the brothers with its blinkers on. A second car, an Audi with Florida tags, which was rented, was also spotted and police found lots of blood and a knife in it. The DA also noted police found the younger Gamble brother lying on the ground with blood on his shoes and his bloody glove. His brother reportedly came running out of a wooded area nearby. Now here's what DA Matt Weintraub had to say about the nature of the crime of this caliber. It is very difficult to kill somebody with a knife and it is uh, often an intimate crime. You have to be within an arm's length to kill somebody with a knife and to stab somebody more than once. Uh, certainly we will, be, we will be arguing that that is evidence of specific intent to kill. Now, investigators say the younger Gamble was seen buying sanitizing gloves and wipes at a 7-Eleven just before that state trooper spotted that parked car. The DA's office said they will be seeking no bail status when both brothers are formally charged later this afternoon. That is the latest. We are live in Doylestown. George Solis, Channel 6 Action News. Back to you guys.